Frankie Beckett. My brother is one of you. Just bring him in here. He can explain everything. Drink? No, thanks. I don't do chems. My brother does them, and he's always getting hurt and sick, so I don't. If it's all the same to you, no thanks. Okay. More. I don't feel okay. Finish it. Is that an eye? Those are eyes. Oh, God. Oh, my God. <laughs> You didn't find Frankie either. Damn it! Well, Foundation wasn't a complete bust. I mean, no one knew where Frankie went, but I did find this holotape. Seems Frankie had a girlfriend. Never thought I'd live to see the day. Oh, poor kid. I hope we can get him out of this mess, if he's still alive. Look, I... I know. It's in the back of my mind all the time right now, okay? But I refuse to give up until I have proof. And I can promise you one thing. Whether Frankie is dead or, 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 or alive, we are gonna hunt down and kill as many of these goddamn blood eagles as we can. <laughs> well, it's hard to say, but... Uh... Usually, when I stand outside and howl his name for an hour or so, he tends to show up. Don't worry, I won't do that while you're around. I promise. Nope, just the holotape. I think maybe they kidnapped her to get to him, but... I mean, that's what they do. That's what they're doing to me right now. I mean, I don't know. I don't know anything other than I feel like this is all my fault. Wait, this is a recording of one of the eyes sessions at the lab. I don't know if I'm ready to listen to that. You know, but I, I suppose I'll have to. Right, while I'm doing that, I need you to help out with a new problem. Words come down that the Blood Eagles are stockpiling poison to use on settlers' food supplies. We can't let that happen. Well, see, he knows a lot of people who see and hear things differently than 
you and I. Sometimes those things are meaningful. So, maybe, doesn't hurt to ask. Look, friend, I understand the impatience, but I, I do, I do, okay? I want closure on Frankie, and I want to watch the Blood Eagles burn. See, the thing is, I need to be a better person, too. Okay, I used to be one of the brainless maniacs that would poison these innocent people with glee. Okay, but today, I decided to be a decent person. I was gonna help some settlers live to see another day. All right, and I asked my friend to help. All right, sounds good. After I listen to the recording, I'll keep looking for Sage. I could use his uh, sense of humor right now. <laughs> Look, you, you might as well ask me, why is it bright when the sun shines? Okay, the blood eagles are insane. All right, after they plant the poison, They'll probably hide nearby just to watch the settlers die one by one. It's a game to them. Actually, I hadn't thought of that. Damn. Well, we'll just have to see it through. We can't miss any opportunity to find him. Just be careful. Okay? Aww, yeah, that's the sweetest thing anybody ever said to me. It's always good to see you around, friend.
spot for this place. Oh boy. Uh, heads up. Here we go. <clears throat> I heard your sweet voice, Beckett. <laughs> Is it time? Look, I don't want to ask, but uh, I just have to. Sage, time for what, buddy? Oh, time for the air to breathe into us instead. Time for the rise to sun, for the memories to forget us. Uh, yeah, um, oh, okay, no. Nope, it's not time. All right, look, I need your help, okay? The Blood Eagles have my brother. Can you help me find him, or what? Oh, a brother found, a brother lost, or somewhere in between, perhaps. Sage, man, I appreciate your help, okay? I, I do, but if you don't give me a straight answer, so help me, I'm gonna pull your heart out through your ribcage. What? Heart? Yes, the heart is at the key. Beckett, the answer is simple. The claw is meant for you and will be exactly where your heart left it. I don't understand. Okay, where my heart left it? Where my heart left my, my, my brother? Okay, that's all you're gonna tell me, isn't it? <sighs> okay, <clears throat> bye, I guess. Thanks. Damn it. Okay, just not sure if any of that was very helpful. Why I put up with that guy, I'll never know. I need to... Stew on what he said, I suppose. The claw is meant for you. And it is exactly where your heart left it. Hey, I know the claw is the last of the three Blood Eagle leaders, but... Is meant for you? I mean, what does that mean? <sighs> Damn to find, though. Look, Sage may sound crazy, but he's never steered me the wrong way. We, we have to trust this will lead us in the right direction. Uh, he's the only Blood Eagle leader I never got a chance to meet. But I heard he's the worst of the three. See, the blood gathers the recruits. The eye extracts valuable information, and the claw... Uh, he just tortures for pleasure. Real stand-up kind of guy. Yeah, well, I, that's gonna happen no matter what Sage says. What about the bit with the heart? Where your heart left it, he said. When the blood told me that I would get to watch everyone I love slowly get shredded in front of my eyes, I, uh, I imagined everything I could do to stop loving anyone. I gladly overdosed on the buff out to burn it. Out of my heart. When I, um, started going overboard with the chems, I guess, when I mixed them up with more. with poisons. with the blood eagles. It's almost as though he's tying the claw and Frankie together. Holy shit. Holy shit, that's it. Okay, Sage was saying that Frankie is being held by the claw. This is perfect. I know exactly what we need to do. I'll grab Ronnie and track down exactly where the claw is keeping Frankie. In the meantime, I need you to hunt down and kill the eye. You think you can handle it? Yeah. Look for a place to dump the eye's corpse when you're done filling him full of bullets. Besides that, look for any info about Frankie. Look, I, uh... I can't thank you enough for everything you've done. Sticking by me like this while I bark orders at you? <laughs> Hell, you're more than just a friend to me. You're like family. 
Thank you. Anything you need before you go? Yeah, that's why I've been biding my time. And after everything we did for her and her uncle Edwin, they owe us. Huge. Now she'd be thrilled to help anyway. Ronnie's been a thorn in the Blood Eagle's side forever. She has got it down to a damn art. What choice will I have, right? <laughs> I mean, no. No, I won't be okay. Yeah? But, uh... You know, eventually... I'll be able to carry on. Hell, I'm learning how to do all sorts of things better. I don't want to learn how to do this, but... I'm preparing for it. Look, please, just be careful. The last thing I want to do is lose someone else that means a lot to me.
goes there.
<laughs> there you are. Two down, one to go, eh? Ha <laughs> ha, we're on a damn roll. While you were dealing with the trash, I managed to get a hold of Ronnie. And she's gonna help us take down the Blood Eagles at their final stronghold. The Watoga Underground. Honestly, I don't know. But Ronnie said she'll fill us in on everything when we get there. Now, if you're wondering what to bring, I'd bring everything you got. Alright, this is the Claw's last stand. And he isn't going down easy. Oh, she's bringing the whole gang. It's, uh, it's gonna be a bloodbath. <laughs> Can't wait. Oh, we will. Just let me ask one thing before we go. You know, I'm just, uh... I'm just a little worried about what's gonna happen after we rescue Frankie and, and, and take down the Claw. You know, my, my work here will be done, but... I mean, where, do, where does that leave us? Well, I'm just... Worried that, uh, you know, when we're done here, you're gonna move on. You know, there might not be room at your camp for a washed up raider and his bar, you know? <laughs> well, that's, uh, that's what I was hoping you'd say. You know, it's, uh, it's kind of funny. <laughs> In another life, you would have made a hell of a raider yourself. <laughs> Imagine that. All right, I'm gonna head out to Watoga Underground and get things set up with Ronnie. You meet us there. Let's do this. <laughs> Mind me. Just taking it all in.